Miss Fabio. Good night, sir. Hello. Hello. Good night. Hello. Good night. How are you? Fine. Hey, tell me, how was the first? day after receiving the paperwork yesterday <laughs> it was yeah it was a lot of work <laughs> yeah of work. you told me that yesterday but was it stressful no today was not that stressful as you thought <laughs> huh? uh, as you thought it was supposed to be right i thought it was it's going to be stressful but for now for this day it wasn't it was kind of tired kind of busy it was not it, it, it was easy it was what i did today it was easy but kind of tired because i have to oh. convert some files to excel they they give some information nothing in excel so they gave me some information that was nothing in excel mm -hmm. and i needed to convert to for me to be able to analyze it <laughs> ah yes it's the takes format right time. that takes time so it was like yeah i could do this it would not it wasn't hard but it consumes time that I just have to yeah. wait, wait. Oh my God. And it depends of exactly what the, the, the volume, right? And or yeah, how big was, is the, is the yeah, file? Yeah, kind of big. So. Uh, I'm sorry to hear that. Tired, well, but... Yeah, I can imagine. I used to work with Excel a lot. Because actually I used to work in um with some hospitals in the United States. It was like extension of the administrative department. Uh, and of course, you know what? You, the, I was really scared, to be honest with you, because by the time that I started uh, working with them, I had around five years or a little bit more without using Excel. Oh my God. So, yeah, oh my God, how am I going to convert that? How am I going to insert uh, um, a line or a column? Like, Oh my God, simple things like that, right? So I was like, and you know, I cried on that, on that, uh, on that business mm -hmm. because I was like, oh my God, no, I had no, I don't have to give up. And especially because um, the department area that I was working with, it, it is uh, regarding the mental health and substance abuse department. So there's a lot of information regarding patients' health. And I got a, search on the website i gotta talk with insurance departments oh goodness and i was like no <laughs> way so it was really really tough i learned a lot especially vocabulary because sometimes uh, they have their own vocabulary their own word their right own terms. yeah even though you're a native speaker sometimes you don't know everything because you have no study medicine right yeah. So, <laughs> yeah so like i learned a lot with them that you cannot imagine yeah that's good uh, no but it was it was frustrating for me at the time because like <laughs> i didn't know what to do yeah and sometimes i need to like convert the file into a a, a top a, uh, i don't know how you say that in in a board into board a uh, table or a table or... yeah as a table yeah. yeah so i said okay what is the next step and I was like, mm, maybe it's like a really simple, right? But imagine having a long time without using a tool, you tend to to forget, especially if they have a, like a new versions. Yeah. Right? Well, because I remember Excel, that, the that the last time that uh, before that, that I worked with Excel was for 2007. <laughs> so of course there have been a really brand new things in, inside our really brand new tools. Right, that I didn't know what is what they were for. Right, so like, <laughs> oh my god! But you know what? I, I, I at least I learned it. And I remember that it was like a deja vu for me, right? Because it was <laughs> attached here in one place of my brain, and I had to like reconnect it again with that area. But oh my goodness, I it was kind of remember you said. <laughs> yeah, because of course there are some things that are like similar right but of course there are really brand new tools brand new buttons etc that are like oh my god and what is this for <laughs> yeah of course in in my areas no it was not like you right like definitely you use all the bottles of excel shit right <laughs> in my case not but at the same time i need to learn and to know the main ones right so it was really so at the beginning it was really frustrated like what I want to cry, I want to quit, quit. And my husband said, no way. You got to keep on going. You got to keep on track. I was like, oh, good. Okay. Ugh. 
but it's when I'm with you, I, I, yeah, I fight with my supervisor. I like, oh my god, yeah, because it was really frustrating. Like, yeah, and he was younger than me. Like, think like you, and yeah, you're younger than me, of course. And I was like, hey, you know what? It was like, but but you gotta do this, but get it like like that, right? And, and he's and also he, he's an English teacher as well. So can you imagine he and me talking at the same time? Oh my god! <laughs> but I, but it was really good actually. I learned a lot with him. Yeah. A Lot. when using those those brown someone else from that uh, when i started in this in this company yeah i i ran you a bit of a cell because they mm -hmm. teach me that in the university i i also in the in the in the high school the high school yeah i use some tools that i i already forget how i how how they were used to um, okay. How I need to be, how, how I need to use them, mm -hmm. and in the that, and when I start, they they make me do a test. Oh, okay. And forgetting the test, I was so funny <laughs> because I I I I knew uh -huh. what the tool do, but I didn't remember how to make that tool do what I need to do. <laughs> ah, I got it, got it. I understand. Yeah. Oh my God! Are you serious? And yeah, I feel I feel very, very scared. <laughs> like I don't know. Oh what my to do, God! Right? Yeah, that happens. That, that happens to you guys. The same thing that we were talking yeah. with uh, Roberto about when you face something brand new for you that you're scared. To you don't know what you're what you will be able to. I don't know to confront that challenge. Or you will have the capability to do something, right? That might be right. I know. But the thing is that we face it, we cry maybe sometimes. <laughs> but uh, here we are, right? Yeah, maybe that had happens at the same time with English, right? Yeah, with English that happens. Yeah, I know. But you know what? I'm so happy that you didn't give up. You're still here. Yeah, and that's seems commitment, willing to learn. And of course, improve English skills, which is the one thing that we're going to do today. Oh, well, every day, right? Every class. But every class focus on different things. Do you remember, by any chance, what was the topic that we saw yesterday? Volunteer, I know everybody wants to participate. I understand yes. that. You love it. Go ahead, Maria. Okay, uh -huh. uh, you, but not me, because I, I didn't participate. Ah, it was me. Ah, I thought it was. But oh, okay. But I, I saw the the video. Ah, okay. okay. And, Good student. Uh, yeah. Oh, thanks. That's, lot. That's the one that I love. <laughs> you talk about the qualities, personality qualities, and positive and negative. Okay. Uh huh. And what else? Very good. Uh -huh. Very good, girl. Well, I don't remember the last part. About uh, the class, the, the relative classes with it and with when, remember that? Oh, yeah. Ah, uh -huh. oh, yeah. I like that. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Very <laughs> good. When. Yes. Okay. Exactly. And do you remember, I don't know if Maria can help us, or maybe Fabio, Francisco, or Henry, I don't know. Oh, do you remember some expressions that we saw yesterday when we're talking about things that we like and we don't like but we're neutral about that oh yes i all remember that he they listened the the, um, the platform okay uh -huh. about uh, what things um annoyed, annoyed, annoyed you. you yeah annoyed you. okay uh -huh. Very good. I, I think I only have one student. No way, that's not possible. Okay, uh huh, Fabio. Help Maria. It bothers too. It bothers, it bothers me. me. Uh huh. Oh, yeah. What else? Uh huh. It upsets me. It upsets me. Yeah. Are you double checking? Oh, uh -huh. teacher. <laughs> teacher. It made me happy. You make me happy. Make me yeah. Happy. What else? Okay. I love it. Uh, I love it, yeah. And I don't, don't mind it. I don't mind it. When you, what is it for you? Is, it doesn't make sense, right? You like it. I or have you a like question. It. Go ahead, Maria. Hey, I remember that you uh, mentioned about um, new expressions or new word, but I can't hear it 
Um, but ah, so what thing. was the new expression, guys? I send that information to the WhatsApp, so you better uh, double check that. Sure, sure thing. thing. Sure thing. Sure thing. Exactly. That's... Sure thing. Let me let me write it down but right now. In in the in the video, I I you didn't I, get it. WhatsApp. Okay. Ah, okay. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, Chat? yeah, it, yeah. It was sent through the WhatsApp, and I I remember, guys, that I sent it to you uh, yesterday, like uh, a page with explanation, right, an example. Oh. So hopefully you have double checked. Hey, Mister Byron already changed the background. Have you seen it? <laughs> uh, you know what? I was expecting a turkey flying over there, or uh, like a, I don't know, like a pumpkin cake. I have one for the last yes. year. <laughs> there so, was a turkey, but I cannot use it, I think so. Why not? Uh, it's because of the company. Ah, yes, I remember that. Yes, exactly. You're right. yeah. But you know what? You can find a turkey on the Google. Yeah. You can find like a Thanksgiving background. <laughs> And yeah, okay. you, may, you can use it. Maybe you can use it by next week, right? Okay, tomorrow. <laughs> well, well no, tomorrow. Week. No, 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 no. Yeah, it's for the yeah, it's for the next week. <laughs> no, actually, no. We're still next week is going. We're gonna start the fifteenth, right? The fifteenth oh, yeah. of November. Yes. So we'll mm. need to wait two more the 25th. weeks. The weeks yes. after next week. Okay. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah, but oh. if you would like to for us to remember, you can start putting that background. <laughs> Yeah, that would be not a problem for me. Yeah, very good job, Maria. Very good, Fabio. He was copying. He was like, I don't mind. It, it doesn't matter me like that, right? But that's okay. Very good job. Those are the expressions that we can use to talk about what, guys? To talk about what? Personalities. Mm, yes, but we saw yesterday oh, about oh. classes with it and we went, remember? And I don't mind, it doesn't bother me, blah, 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 blah. We can use that expressions to talk about what? Comparisons. No, not really. Not, no, yet. <laughs> complaints? For a situation? Complaints for a situation, complain. for complaints, all, also to talk about things that annoy you, things that you like, things that you don't like, or things that you is neutral for you. Okay, do you remember that? All right, very good, very good job, guys. Excellent. I I love that you participate. <laughs> uh, you see that every time I make a recap, just to double check as a friendly reminder, right? And also to help your coworkers or your classmates that for some reason were not able to attend to class, like Maria, for example, right? For any reason, right? Health, family, work problems, work issues. So she will be able to be in the same space, right? Okay, now, guys, I wanna. I, let you know something today remember that we're going to focus on pronunciation and still listening yep so um i didn't let you know anything yesterday or i didn't correct you yesterday because basically we're going to work on that today so sometimes when we uh, read about i i love it when people blah 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 blah, blah i can't stand when la, 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 la. when you use that expressions sometimes we have to like join sentences, especially when it ends it up in the consonant and right next to it, we have a vowel. So sometimes we need to like join it in order not to sound like robot, but at the same time to sound more natural and that our um, pronunciation and our speaking is fluent. So we gotta learn how to join the sentences or how to join the words but where we need to join it. So right now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to be very nice. Okay, I'm going to be a very nice teacher. Don't worry about it. But first of all, I'm going to play an audio for you, and I'm just going to let you identify where, just by listening, right, where I need supposed to join the ideas. And maybe I will ask you where you think you need to like join it. And then I'm gonna show you my slate and then we can double check if you were right or if you were wrong, right? So don't worry about that, don't get panicked. Okay, so are you guys ready? Hey, we have a new a new student. There's a baby while we're home out there. Oh, I love her cheeks. <laughs> All righty, very good. Oh, you see, he's 
smiling. Oh, I love baby smile, my heart. That, that broke my heart. <laughs> All righty, very good. So let me just a couple of minutes. And now, yeah, guys, yes. I'm not gonna mix it up with the with the sound, okay? I promise. I promise. I'm gonna. I don't gonna mess up. All right. So let me just a couple of minutes. Hey, um, Elsita. Hey, Omar. Hey, Anita. How you doing? Welcome to the class. Hello, teacher. How are you? Pretty, pretty, pretty good. What about you? Fine, thank you. Hey, I have Rigo here and Gabby and Henry and other Henry. So I have Mr. Molina and Mr. Monterosa. That's cool. We have two Henrys here. I love it. All righty. So, ready? Okay. Page five, exercise nine. Pronunciation. Linked sounds. Part A. Listen and practice. Final consonant sounds are often linked to the vowel sounds that follow them. It upsets me when a person is unreliable. I love it when a friend is supportive and kind. One more time? No, all right. Okay. Teacher, did you did you get it when you had to link or no? Not really, right? It was hard, right? But that's what I want you to do from now on. But don't worry. You we're gonna practice. Okay? practice of it, like all your horses okay all your horses all righty i want to show it to you right now and uh let me and after that we're gonna um sh listen again so you will be able to see what we're talking about but let me check it out really quickly i think i'm going to make it a little bit bigger it depends if you can see it can you see it guys can you see my screen or no? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah or no? Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. So I, I want you guys to pay attention or how the final consonant sounds are often linked to a vowel. For example, in the first sentence, we got one, two, three, four links. And in the second sentence as well, we got a four links. But can you see here? It is a, is a consonant sound, right? What is that next to it? We have a vowel, right? You upsets. Then also happens here when a person is unreliable. So you see that we have four links for link it. Yeah. Okay. So you can say it upsets me when a person is unreliable. You see, you don't stop. It ups. Say it one more time. It ups for me. Oh, Can you repeat it, guys? It ups. Can you repeat it? It ups. It ups. It ups. Buena. 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 Persons. Buena. Persons. Unreliable. Unreliable. Persons are unreliable. Persons are unreliable. unreliable. Buena. Persons are unreliable. Says with my persons are unreliable. That's it's up. It ups. 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 So you see, it ups. It upsets it me up. when a person is unreliable. You see, it we join the ideas. It upsets me. 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 When a person, when a person, when a person is unreliable, is unreliable. Is unreliable. Very good. Unreliable. Take a look at the second one. I love it when a friend is supported and kind. I love, I love it when, it. I love when, it. I love it when a friend is supported and kind. I love it. I love it. When a friend, when a friend is supported and kind. When a when a friend is love it. I love it when a friend is supported and kind. When a friend is supported and kind. Very good. So let's do something. I'm gonna guys play it again the audio. I will leave my sleigh right now, so you will be able to see. Where you're going to listen, but I want you ah, guys Jose. to pay it. Hey, Perdón. Jose, how are you? Sorry. <laughs> sorry. No, that's okay. But I want you guys to take a look while you're listening to uh -huh. these sports, to the to the joints, to the link it. So you will be able to see about the or listen about the pronunciation. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yes. 
pronunciation. Linked sounds. Part A. Listen and practice. Final consonant sounds are often linked to the vowel sounds that follow them. It upsets me when a person is unreliable. I love it when a friend is supportive and kind. You see, guys? Is it easy? What are less? Yeah, but you, we, we gotta practice, right? Yes, yeah, and it's difficult to understand when other people speak at uh, very speed. Exactly. That's why the listening is important. Because as in Spanish in Salvador, we have our own accent, right? And we have the own speed of a speaking. Is in English is worse. <laughs> Not only uh, if you're Canadian, Jamaican, Australian, uh, British, e even in the United States, guys. Oof. Depends of the state you're coming from. You you could have a very strong accent. If you're listening to Louisiana girls, oh my goodness. The black girl, you know, no, yeah. Oof. What about the one for Houston, Texas, like the Mr. X President George W. Bush? Oof. They don't even open their mouth. They just speak like this. <laughs> yes, it is. So so um that's why I had to put those audios for you because I want you guys to pay attention and to also develop your listening. That is one of the hardest ones. It is one of the hardest ones. May I ask you something by any chance? I recently have sent you uh, like a dictation, right? Dictation video. It talks about email addresses. Yeah. By any chance, did you get the opportunity to practice that? Uh-huh. So you better be. Why? Because, guys, we, on, we don't only in our works, we don't only send messages. We receive messages. And it's really crucial and important to understand when they're asking us about uh, hyphen, when they're asking about dot, at yes right lowercase uppercase um capital letter capital letter low, exactly we need to understand oh. not only the symbols that we use in the email address but at the same time the letters and expressions why because not all the time the email addresses will be like a real ones sometimes they fake it right we can say it, hello kitty at gmail.com for example and it's my <laughs> gmail address right? Sometimes you mix it up with your first name and last name. Sometimes you add a number between a letter, right? And sometimes it's like a tigger.sv, right? So sometimes you invented that. And you said, ah, I know that Carmen, I know Carmen spells with C as in zero, a C as in cat, but guess what? This Carmen is with K as in kilo. So that's why it is really, really important to practice a dictation. And I send it to you because this is a British accent. And it's one of the hardest one to understand. Mm -hmm. Especially mm -hmm. because when they mention, for example, the J and the H, they have a really particular sound when they use that letter. So you better practice. I have sent it to you an email. I'm gonna send you also dictation about um, names. I will send a dictation about last names and also dictation about mailing addresses. Not only for you to understand how you put street, avenue, et cetera, also that you're, you need to learn uh, what is the abbreviation from the states, right? Oh, how you say Ohio is OH, California, C8, and something like that, right? Washington, WA. Pennsylvania, PA, right? Tennessee, TN. But also after that, most of the time the zip code is only four numbers, right? So it's really, really important that you practice that. Okay. You know what? I will also try to see if I can search Canadian zip code. Why? 
because Canadian circles are, are between letters and numbers. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, I'm, but right now I'm gonna send it to you, not names and last names, and then I think on Thursday I'm gonna send it to you. We'll give you one one day off, right? Just for you to relax. <laughs> but then I'm, on Thursday I'm gonna send it to you addresses, and all of them will be British, all of them, because I want you guys to get used to it. You you are used to American accent, but as I was advised to you before. I would like you to get used to a different kind of accents because you're going to talk with a different kind of people for different backgrounds. Right, Mr. Byron? Mm -hmm. Even yeah. though you work so, in a call center, as Mr. Byron does, even though, but you're, go you're going to relate or with a lot of people around the world. So that's why, sorry, sorry. Welcome to the jungle, guys. <laughs> Welcome to the class, all right? Okay, very good. So now do me a favor. I, now that you have listened, double it, I want you guys to practice, okay? So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna post right now on the chat the two sentences that we have already listened and I want you guys to help me with the pronunciation. I'm gonna post it, first of all, one, and then <clears throat> I'm going to post it a second one. Okay, so let me just a couple of minutes. Okay, I'm going to I'm going to write it down. Okay, the first one. It upsets me when a person is unreliable. Okay, volunteer to try to pronounce it correctly. Uh huh. Maria. Okay, Maria. Okay, ladies first. Come on. Okay. All righty. Go ahead. Go ahead, Maria. Okay. It upsets when me. Oh, excuse me. Okay. All right, but is is uh, the the T is the T. Oh, I mean the T, the letter G or the T that you. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Did she drink chamomile by chance? It upsets. It upsets me when a person is unreliable. All right, very good, very good, good try, excellent, good try, Maria. Uh, Mr. Francisco, go ahead. I accept me when a person is unreliable. I accept. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. As I, 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 oh, my God, I make a mistake. Nobody yeah. said right. Uh, you, you eat the tea. I accept. I, I, yeah. mean, I accept. No, but it was on purpose <laughs> and nobody said anything. Come on. But I, I, I pronounce it. <laughs> uh, uh, I was expecting that somebody would let me know something, but now nah. only Francisco. Ah, yeah, yeah. Sir, you eat the tea. I okay. I know, but I ate it. It's not because I'm hungry, because I already um, <laughs> I, I already have my my uh, my dinner, right? It is because I was waiting for somebody who let me know. Teacher, you made a mistake, and nobody did. Okay, very okay, good. I I, 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 can I repeat? Of course, okay. of course. Go ahead. The microphone's all yours. Okay. It upsets me when a person is unreliable. Very good. Oh my goodness, what a radio voice you have today. Okay. <laughs> and I was like, ah, do it again, please. Ah, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All righty, very good. Uh, another lady, thank you so much. Anita, go ahead. Teach it, but I can, I can see the, the WhatsApp. Because no, 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 it's not in the WhatsApp, Anita. It's in the Zoom chat. Yes, but I can I, I can see uh uh can see a sentence because I only I use a, a my smartphone. Ah, uh, I got it, got it, got it. I understand. Don't worry about that. It will be a little bit harder. Yes, I understand. But don't worry. But what I want you to do right now, I need us to pay attention of your classmates' pronunciation. Okay. Okay. Okay, Elsita. What about you? What you have for us? Oh, yeah, I knew what she said. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I will try. Go ahead. It upsets me when a person is unreliable. Very good. I like it. 
I like it, but do me a favor because you 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 make a stop when you said it upsets me <clears throat> when a person is yeah, reliable. I so what okay. I want you to do is to like take a deep breath, okay. right, and say it in <laughs> once. Uh, okay. <laughs> Okay, can okay. I? Okay. Yes, do your best. It upsets me when a person is unreliable. Very good, but once again. <laughs> okay. It upsets me when a person is unreliable. You know what? I don't believe you. <laughs> because you said that it is accepts you when a person is unreliable, but you need to sound like you're upset, if you're annoyed about that. Okay, go ahead. Mm. It <laughs> no, okay. no, you're laughing. It upset me when a person I really I don't believe you. You gotta you gotta sound self-confident, right? Yeah. Okay, okay yeah. go ahead. You can do it. It upsets me when a person is unreliable. Now I believe you. Very good. You see, <laughs> she's more serious, right? All right. Yeah. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Next big team. Sorry. Next participant. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let me double check. Kathy. Thank you, Kathy. You're an amazing girl. <laughs> it, it upset. It upset. I'm sorry. It upset me when a person is unreliable. I, I don't believe you, so you gotta give a try it again. I, I don't believe you too. Yes, right? <laughs> I know. Do your best. Do your best. Take a deep breath. Is it any worse? Every time. You do your best, yes. Okay. It upset me when a person is unreliable. Now I believe you're much better. Very mm -hmm. good. Very good. Omar, you wanna give a try? <laughs> okay. It upsets me when a person is unreliable. Oh my goodness, I believe you. You scared me. Yes, I, like, believe ah! <laughs> I believe you. I believe you. And I can see this, the screen right now. It's a memory, used my memory only. Oh my goodness, you're such a genius. I like no. it. <laughs> nah, nah, ah, come on, oh, you're so no, modest. <laughs> no, but very good, good job, excellent. Excellent. And Byron, what about you? Sorry. Okay. <laughs> I no. couldn't change the mute. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it upsets me when a person is unreliable. Very good. But don't smile, okay? <laughs> no, sorry. <I> can... <laughs> That's okay. No problem. Rafael, I saw I you, Rafael. Come on. Hey, Rafa. Hey, welcome, Rafa. Welcome to the jungle. Welcome to this class. This crazy class. Yes, I know that. <laughs> Rafa, Thank you, do, teacher. <laughs> do me a favor. Uh, could you try to pronounce what we're talking right now? Yep. Go ahead. Uh, it accepts uh, me when the person is unreliable. Very good. Also, you have a radio voice. Like Francisco. It's going to be a bottle between <laughs> you and Frank. Okay, that's cool. Thank you. All righty, uh, 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 Rigoberto, what about you? Rigoberto, Rigoberto, Hello, teacher. hello. Can you I'm pronounce sure. it for us, please? It upsets me when a person is unreliable. Very good, Gabby. It upsets me when a person is reliable. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that is the more self-confident that I've heard today. Oh, that's amazing. Excellent. Henry, Henry Monterosa. <laughs> what uh, about Monterosa you? Monterosa is with C. Okay. With Z as a zebra, yes. <laughs> with C. Okay. It upsets me when a person is unreliable. Very good. But do me a favor, Henry. Do, do not put it's, it. It upsets me. It Don't upsets use... me. Aha, uh -huh, great. Very good. Okay, okay. It, it upsets me when a person is unreliable. 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 Well, unreliable. Once unreliable. again, you can do a search. Unreliable. Unreliable. <laughs> Unreliable. It's like a tongue twister. Unreliable. Is it? No, it's not a tongue twister. <laughs> no, no, it's, it's, I can sing your tongue twister if you want to. Do I have well. problems to, to, okay. to the pronunciation of the of the word. I know. You, that's why we're practicing. Go ahead. Unreliable. 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 
Unreliable. Doesn't Unreliable. matter. Unreliable. Yeah, don't feel like if you sometimes we need to make to be like goofies, right? Remember God? Remember goofies? <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so try to pronounce it correctly. But that is while our facial muscles get used to the sound. After you practice it, it will come up easily. Way, right? So it could be like unreliable, right? Like ah, open your unreliable. mouth. Like, ah. uh -huh. Unreliable. And then you said, "Oh my God, my cheeks hurts a little bit." Yeah. So okay, do it again. Okay, it upsets me when a person is unreliable. Unreliable. <laughs> unreliable. Right. Do me a favor. Unreliable. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. Okay, okay, unreliable. Okay. Unreliable. Unreliable. <laughs> Liable. Unreliable. There you go. Unreli unreliable. There you go. That it is. Okay. That's it. That's it. So Unre go ahead. Unreliable. Unreliable. It, it upsets me when a person is unre unreliable. Yeah. Good job, sir. Uh, Give me the I need five. to practice more this war. That's what I need. I know. Okay. And your mama said, What happened to you, Harry? Why are you like this? I don't know why. Hey, what's about today's class, ma'am? <laughs> All righty, very good. Shall we practice the second one? Yeah, right. Okay, let's practice the second one. Um, mm -hmm. I remember that it says, I love it when a friend is supportive and kind. Let me check. Yes, I think so. Yeah. I love it when a friend supported him kind, right? Remember that? Yeah. Okay. Big team volunteer. Thank you, Fabio. Go ahead. <laughs> I knew it was like a... I love it when a friend supports them in kind. Very good. Uh, Anita Pineda, go ahead, my girl. I love it when a friend is supportive and kind. Supportive, supportive and kind. Supportive, supportive and kind. Very good. Mirnita Noemi, what about you, girl? Hello, teacher. Hello. I love it when a friend is supportive and kind. Very good. You know what? I love your tone of voice because it sounds real what you said. Very good. Excellent. Henry with M, uh, without H, Mr. Molina. Mr. Molina, Mr. Molina, hello, hello. sir. Could uh, you repeat it once again? I love it when a friend is supportive and kind. Could you please repeat it for us? <laughs> Do your best. I know you can. No, no. Yes, you can, uh, sir. Yes. Uh, I, I, I love it. I love I, it. I, I, uh, I don't know uh, when I when I when when I can read this this uh, this sentence. Uh, yes, it is. It is on the chat. Do you have it with you? Oh, chat. Okay. On the on the Zoom chat. Yes. Okay. Sorry, but. No, that's okay. Chat, chat, chat. Uh -huh. In the Zoom chat right now, you will be able to sign it, to find it. Right, guys? Chat, chat. I can't. Chat, okay. Harry, are I you don't... with Zoom? Are you using Zoom yeah. right now? Yeah, yes. Okay, so on the lower part, when, when we have like the gallery, when you can see everybody, on the lower part, you will see participants. So oh, how many okay. we are. And next to it is an icon that says chat. Oh, oh okay, okay. Click on okay. that. More. Chat. Mm -hmm. I love it. Very good. I love it. Uh, 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 I love it when a friend. 
Uh, I love it when a friend is supportive and kind. Very good. Good job, Henry. Good job. I okay. knew you could do it. Yeah. Thank you for helping me. You. No, thank you. Thank you for trying. That's good. Excellent. Very good job. Thank you see you. everybody's like, yeah, go Henry. Go okay. Henry. You can do it. Yeah, that's cool. All righty. Thank you, Henry. Okay, Alex, you. what about you? What do you have for us? Okay. I love it when a friend is supportive and kind. Very good. Me, Marillita. Me? Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, it's the only Marillita that I have here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I love it when a friend is supportive and kind. Very good. Francisco? You know what? You, you have yourself on mute. Oops. Sorry. Okay. I love it when a friend is supportive and kind. Very good. Elsita. I love it when a friend is supportive and kind. Very good, Omar. I love it when a friend is a supportive and a kind. Very good, good job. Uh, Byron. I love it when a friend is supportive and kind. Oh, I love your tone of voice, very good. Excellent job, good job guys, so you see? You see how it is? Of course, we need to like get more practice, right? <laughs> so you know what? Since we already have leasing, we already have practice and all of that. Basically, guys, I'm going to left you a homework. Yes, I will send you, I think right now, I'm going to send it to you, three sentences. And this is what I want you to do for me. Tomorrow, that's the first thing that we're going to double check. Um, I want you guys to identify where you need to like link the words, right? It could be one, two or four, depends. And then I want you guys to practice the pronunciation because the teacher is really nice, but sometimes it could be like dedocratically, right? I could pick two, three or four that you're going to let me know, right? Where you put the link. And at the same time, I'm gonna ask you the pronunciation for that, right? Just remember that we are linking the, the consonant sounds with a vowel, right? Remember that? So I'm going to mm -hmm. send it to you right now and just let me know when once you receive it, please, because I need to make sure that you have it. Okay, just to make sure about that, bear with me for a couple of minutes more. Okay, I just sent it to you. Do you got it? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Cool. All righty. So that's the three. There's only three sentences. It's not complicated. No. But please try to remember what we have seen. Uh, do me, I'm going to be a nice teacher as well, because I remember that Byron sometimes said, teacher, please send a copy to the WhatsApp about your presentation and all the stuff. Right. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to do something here. I will send you just this one, just the one that we have seen right now. <sighs> because I love you guys, right? And then that will help you to do your homework. Is that okay? Yeah, you got it? Yep. Okay. All right, very good. Okay. So now guys, this is what we have finished with this topic. So hopefully, you have practiced a lot. You have learned a lot. And if you still have any doubts or any questions, don't ask me. Don't know. I'm <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm just teasing you. Yeah, you feel free to ask me, okay? Anytime, anytime. Uh, you can send me a message. You can ask right now. But please, guys, I'm a really nice teacher and try to answer as soon as I can because I'm, do I'm doing a lot of things on during the day, right? Have another job right now. But, uh, and I will be, as soon as I'm able, I'm going to answer right now. However, please, 
I'm not 24 <laughs> seven. You know what? I remember once, guys, when I uh, I have one of my students, so I was let let them know about that, right? And guess what? At what time he was, he sent me a message that I was almost afraid and scared because when you receive a message around 11, 12, or one, it could be because of an emergency, right? Yeah. Yes. And he sent me a message at. 11 59 p.m and i was like what and i was like you know that day it was really hard for me to go back to sleep and i was like this and then <laughs> i was like oh no so i woke up and said teacher i just like oh my goodness like yesterday i'm gonna kill this guy <laughs> tomorrow i'm gonna kill this guy no but no but no that's that's what i'm like it is like um it's a joke well, it's not a joke. What that really happens? That really happens. But just to let you know that I'm not totally twenty four seven. Okay. Be okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I just want to be considered with this poor teacher, please. <laughs> All righty, guys. Very good. So we finished this topic. We're gonna start with a new topic, which is basically jobs. All of you have different jobs, right? You're working in different areas. You work in different environments, etc uh-huh so of course you love what you do and you you have to remember uh about the adjectives that we saw because we're going to use them and we're going to also learn something new today um i want to share with you something guys this is regarding top jobs in america mm -hmm. but i want you guys to help me not only help me read but at the same time um let me know which one you are agreeing, which one you're not agree with. Uh, let me double check right now. Uh, 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 um, yes. And then I will let you know what else we're gonna do with it. Uh, would you like me to make it a little bit bigger? Or is that okay? Okay. Really? That is okay. Mm, you it's okay. See? It's okay. But, yes. All right, okay. I will do my best, but if you say if it's okay, it's okay. Alrighty, guys. Uh, volunteer, thank you so much, Omar, with simulation engineer. Go ahead, please. <laughs> simulation engineer, you develop different kinds of simulators, such as applied simulators for training pilots or virtual patients and training medical students. Very good. And virtual patients. Patients. All right. Very good job. Uh, continue reading for me, uh, 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 Fabio. Okay, help informatic technician use use you use computer system to update fa patient file, which help doctors diagnose and treat patients. Very good. We'll help okay. doctors diagnose and treat patients. <laughs> treat patients. Very good. Very good. <clears throat> Uh, 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 Maria, green researcher. Green researcher. Uh, you research new environmentally friendly technologies for fair, for fields such as <laughs> energy and recycling. Very good. Okay. Organic food farmer, Kathy. <laughs> Organic food farmer. You grow healthy food in a sustainable way without using harmful pesticides or chemicals. Very good. And last but not least, social media manager, Gabby. Um, social media manager. You control the representation of a company's brand online on sites like Facebook, Twitter, and others. Ah, you already get used to it, right? I'm <laughs> just kidding. All righty, very good. Good job, guys. Just try to practice some um, song words, okay? To improve our um, speaking. Repeat after me, develop. 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 Such as. Such as. Such as. Such as. Such as, such, as, such, as, such, as, such as flight simulators, flight, flight, flight simulators. simulators, virtual patients, virtual patients. patients. Medical, <laughs> students. 
Many college students. students. I know, no students. Students. Know, students. students. Yes. Many college students. students. Because there's no E, remember? Students. Very good. Um, Many college students. Update patients files. Patience files. Why why I'm I'm double checking on these guys because you see that there is a uh S and Patience. apostrophe and then we have files. That means that when when you're using an S and when it's a plural thing, you need to like uh let uh, uh, your listener that you're talking about plural things. You don't it's not patient files, mm. it's patients files so it, it is really important to pronounce the s yeah. all righty let's diagnose diagnose, diagnose. treat diagnose. patients treat patients research research environmentally environmentally feels 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 such as Recycling. Recycling. Grow. 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 Sweetable. Sweetable. Very good. Sustainable. or Sustainable. You can say it either or. Without using harmful pesticides. You control the presentation of a. You control the presentation of a. Companies brand online on sites like Facebook, Twitter, and others. Companies brand and others. Very good. I'm going to stop on something right now really quickly because it's really quickly. We're going to continue with that because we need to continue with that, guys. But um, um I want you guys to make the difference of something right now. Because I detect that freaking in all the last the classes, I detect that. So I just want you to be fixed right now. When you have O and double F. You pronounce off, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. And when you have an O and one F, you gotta pronounce it like of. 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 Don't pronounce. Don't pronounce. Don't pronounce it off. No, it's of. 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 All right. So th that of. there's a different pronunciation. Of. So that's why, guys, I want you to pay attention on that. I said, I'm, I will try to help you with the pronunciation as much as I can. Because I okay. 10 years in a call center is, is not enough. My ear is really developed that you cannot imagine. Okay. I can just detect when something is like, uh -uh, we got to fix on that. So let's go back and try to pronounce it in the right way. Okay. So let me go back and share right now my screen. And favor, please pronounce the last one. Social media manager, you, you control the presentation of a company's brand. Does that? Social media manager. Social media manager to control. Uh -huh. To control the representation <laughs> of a company's brand. Social media manager, you control of a party. Of a presentation of a company oh, brand online. Very good. Very good. You see, it's different, right? Of a, uh, of a uh, presentation. Uh, exactly. Uh, Very uh, good job. Uh, now, guys, what we have um, read with, with your help as well, basically, will it will be related to hot jobs or demands careers of the future. So let me ask you, on the rank... The career from one, which is most interesting, to five, the less interesting, according to the one that we have just seen. And let me go back so you can have like an idea. For you guys, which one is more interesting? Which is, for example, you, Byron, for you, which will be more in interesting? Simulator engineer, health informatic technician, 
green researcher, organic farmer, farmer or social media manager? I think simulation engineer. Okay, what would be the least interesting for you? For me? Mm -hmm. <laughs> for you? Um, Talking about organic this. Organic food farmer. Ah, maybe. Okay, okay. <laughs> Very good. Noemi, what about you? What would be the, the most interesting for you, Noemi? Social media manager. All righty. And the least interesting? Why? What? And the least interesting, the one that you don't, you're not interesting at all? What is not interesting? The, the one that is not, that you don't, you don't like to, to, uh, to have that kind of job. You said that the, mo the, the more interesting for you, the most interesting is social media manager, you said, right? Yes. But which, which one, you, would you like to be an organic food farmer? No. No, right? So it is the least interesting for you. Okay. okay. Very good. So guys, do me a favor. Besides the one that we have seen so far, can you think about another um, careers that will be in demand in the future? Uh, something Career? to to artificial artificial intelligence development is is going to be a demand. Okay, why? Why you say that? Are you agree with Fabio guys, or you have a, a, another um, example? Explain, Fabio, please. Uh, artificial intelligent development. Mm -hmm. I say I this because the Fabio. meta, okay. the thing is doing Mark Zuckerberg with the I, program I think for, that, for yes, that in the future, intelligence, mana intelligence developers uh -huh. are, are going to be very, very important okay. because the robots and the, the platforms like YouTube have. Uh, Virtual intelligence mm -hmm, to exactly to administrate the, a lot of information of people. A humans can uh, administrate the the information. The Very lot of, good of data. So Omar I is think, agree with uh, you and also Francisco. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's important in the future the internet in the of the things because mm -hmm. uh, the um, uh, refrigerator the stuff and microphone, microwave, sorry, uh, needs internet connected on Wi-Fi. Mm, really interesting. Okay, so talking about that, guys, and you say that uh, artificial wealth developer is gonna be uh, one of the <laughs> demand careers in the future. Uh, now tell me something, what jobs do you think will not be in demand in the future? Now let's think in, in, in an opposite way. Software okay. developers. Software developers? <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Here is a, come on, of course not. <laughs> <laughs> what is the name of the person that administrate uh, a library? Like, bibliotecaria, I don't know. How do you say in English? How do you say it in English? Bibliotecaria. <laughs> I think Francisco is going to search library. for it. Libraries. Liberian. 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 <laughs> Liberian in the future don't have job because normally... Don't have uh, job or won't have job? Uh, won't. Won't have, won't have job. Won't yeah. have job because uh, normally all, way, all is in digital now and you you can search in a browser and take a book and so it's different. <laughs> I, I like Mr. Henry. He's fighting. He's like, you know, man. Uh, yeah. 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 He, he, he is, he's like a fish, right? right? Like a fish in the ocean, right? Yeah. Very good. Yeah. You're, you're right about that. Very good. Okay. So, guys, when you talk about uh, what is like to be, uh, or to like, um, yeah, to be in a certain job or to play a certain position in um in your life but or in the company, there is a specific grammar that we use. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Yeah. You see? <laughs> so right now I'm gonna do something. 
I will send you right now to the WhatsApp because we're going back to the listening part. I told you that you were going to develop the listening. And uh, I want you guys to pay attention about um, this person that are basically what they are doing. It is like a, a career debate. There are people talking about jobs. And what I want you guys to do is just to listen to that. And they're going to talk about one, two, I think three or four jobs. And each of them will have their own opinion. So I'm going to send you something right now. because It is something that basically what you're going to listen. To. But I want you guys to check or, or think about which of the um, uh, expressions or point of view you are agree with. Okay? That's what I want. So I send it to you right now. Do you have it? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. All right. So it's a. It is. Uh, we're gonna listen to talk about jobs, and I just want you guys to let me know if you agree or disagree. That's all that I need. Just allow me one moment because I need to like pop it up something really, really quickly. There you go. Yes. There you go. I have it here. <laughs> I don't want to miss that. Very good. All righty. Okay. Yes, sir. All right. That's what I want. There you go. Okay. So let me share right now my screen, guys, and just try to pay attention to what they say. Okay. I'm going to play it only one time today. Perspectives. Career debate. Part A. Listen to the people talk about jobs. Do you agree or disagree? Check the speaker you agree with more. Being a flight attendant sounds very exciting. Flying all the time would be fun. But flight attendants get tired of traveling. They spend most of their time in airports. Designing clothes is not a man's job. Women are much more fascinated by fashion. That's not true. Many great clothing designers are men. Just look at Calvin Klein. I'd enjoy working with animals. I think working as a veterinarian could be rewarding. I'm not so sure. Animals can be very unpredictable. Getting a dog bite would be scary. I'd like to work in the television industry. Directing a TV show would be really interesting. I disagree. Working in front of the camera as an actor would be much more satisfying. All right. So tell me. Let me go ahead. Let me pop it up right now, the one that I sent it to you. And let's share. There you go. Guys, do me a favor. On the first one, the first one, the first two squares are talking about flight attendants. Uh, you agree with the first or with the second um, point of view? First. I'm, I'm agree. First. 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 It will be, do you think it will be fun, fly, fun to fly all around the world? Yeah. <laughs> to be exciting, yeah? yeah. But, but it's yes, it's exciting. But it's what you said? Tired. Tired, yeah. 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 Tired. So I think you, you agree with the second one, right, girl? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, I very good. With the second one. You agree with the second one too, Omar? Okay. What about designing clothes? Second one. Second one? Second one. Second one. Are you agree that second women one. are much fascinated by fashion? I agree with the second one. I'm agree with the second, second one too. Yes, yes of course. Yeah. Definitely. Mr. Combin Klein is a really good one. All righty. What about the third one? What about working with animals as a veterinarian? First the first, first one? one. The first do you one. love animals? Yeah. Yes, I love yes, animals. I do. That's the first one. Yeah, I'm not scared about working with animals. Those are fantastic. I love it. What about the last one? Television industry, directing a TV show. The first one. The first, the first one. Second one. First one. So the second, second one, Maria. <laughs> okay. One. So we are in divided opinions, right? 
Some of you say first one, some of you second ones. Okay. Second one. The second one, first, second one. Okay. Why I have mentioned to you this and why I have left this listening uh, activity at the last for one reason. Because this one is going to be the our rich for tomorrow's class. Okay. Yeah. And because if do me a favor, guys, please try when you have time like right now or maybe tomorrow during the day, cl pay close attention to how they express themselves, how they express their point of view about what, what is good or not good to be a flight attendant, veterinarian, and things like that, because that will help you a lot to understand much better tomorrow's topic, because tomorrow's topic, we're going to talk about gerunds, but gerunds as a subject and gerunds as an object. <sighs> And in that way, that will help us to understand how it works and also to express ourselves when we're talking about our career or when we're talking about another people's careers, like the one that we have heard. All righty. And you will see how practical is grammar. You see, so far, grammar, you have no grammar or no yet. Hey, you have my, I have, I still have my <laughs> I am still trying to love it. Okay, but uh, not much, but okay, don't worry. So, so, I got, so, so you will love it, will me? I promise. Yeah. All righty. The grammar is my big problem. No problem? No. Yes, no, it's my, it's my big problem, the grammar. But right really? now, so far, so okay. good? Yeah. <laughs> Sure. Okay. <laughs> no, that's okay. <laughs> so remember, tomorrow we have a, a homework. Please don't forget. Okay. okay. And guys, you know what? Time passed really fast. It's already not a four or four minutes after nine. Oh my God. I know you love me. <laughs> and I love <laughs> you too. But I know that you're so tired and some of you haven't eat, right? Okay. So please, Anita, drink your cup of coffee. <laughs> and share one with me <laughs> all righty guys i love you so much i'm so happy to have you once again in class so hugs and kisses have a lovely night okay thank you. take care thank you, thank you. See you tomorrow bye -bye. Bye -bye.